Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with Call of the Wild, the Angler, and we are here at night. I uh, have the Diamond's Peak map challenge activated, and I think, I'm not sure if I'm going to do that or, ex well, exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to actually go to the journal here, and this is really a very useful tool for this game, guys, because this is where you kind of track your missions that you can take part in, plus these other missions like you have on the bulletin board, like catch a smallmouth bass. Now I've caught plenty of them but I've never actually gone through the the actual you know tutorial mission which I might just do to finish up eventually. Not gonna do it here because you know we've done it but this is the one that is one of uh, Sophie's missions. I did the first one which had me down here to catch a largemouth bass. Um, this one is catch a gold rank largemouth bass at this map location which I'm pretty sure I know where that is but I think I'm gonna have to walk there most likely but I tell you what's got me really intrigued oh there's somebody what's got me really intrigued is this legendary fish thing I mean yeah I really want to catch one of those <laughs> I mean that sounds like it's gonna be a lot of fun and so cool but okay how do we do that how do we get started I mean it gives you a little bit of information and it does give you a rundown of the best gear to use to catch them because apparently they're pretty tricky. They're wily, wily Ocuses. And they're not going to be, well, they wouldn't be legendary if they weren't challenging. But how would we find out where to get them? Now, I did catch a diamond largemouth bass in the last episode up in that one little area, if you check the map here. I mean, I caught him. You know, right up here. No, not right here. It's right here. A lot of gold ones here too. I mean, that would be a possibility, a good of a good location. I don't know. And I think one of them. I'm trying to remember his name. If you come in here to the main menu, when the main menu comes up you can go to news and updates and it does tell you about the legendary catches right here and it does pull it up on a web page and finding it that's the that's the trick there's only three of them right now I don't think Norway has one per se this one has three and there's only one for each week once you catch one you have to wait a week for the next one becomes available and you don't know which one's available which if you could find out which one it is, it would definitely make it a lot easier. But this is Goldstein. He's the largemouth bass. Man, I would love to catch Goldstein. I wouldn't mind catching Big Larry either. He's the channel catfish. Now, I've caught plenty of channel cats right out here in this big part of the lake. And then there's Sidewinder, the lake trout. It just says, can you find these legendary fish? Will you share their, your insights with other anglers or keep your discoveries to yourself? Hmm. I really want one of them, guys. <laughs> I really, really do. This side one of the lake trout, you have to have 45 kilogram line to catch him. So thinking you're, I'm a ways away from getting to him. Now, Big Larry, you need 15 kilogram. You need 15 kilogram for Goldstein. So, I'm not even sure if I have the tools for that yet. I just... I don't know. I just really want one of those bad. <laughs> As you can imagine. 
But we may have to just continue on as we are, unless we can get some insight from somebody. I mean, guys, I tell you, I know some of you are playing this. Golden Ridge Reserve Legendary Fish Active. He's here! Where the hell is he? And what is he? Guys, if you can put something down in the comments, let me know. What do you do? Is there something I can do to help figure this out? Do you Have you got any clues? Has anybody caught them? Ugh. Really want to know this. I do have some cash on Hello hand, there. guys. It's never too late for a good bargain. Unless you miss it. Which in this case you might. But you haven't yet. Jeez, she talks a lot. She is kind of cute, right though. Place. Let's see here. <sighs> hmm. Well, let's check our equipment here. They've added... Okay. They have added a lot of new spinning rods. Plus, I got the new DLC they just had out that was free. Wait a minute. Did it just say I had 68 coins? Oh, okay. I must have... I guess I bought... Yeah, I did. I did buy some stuff. I didn't realize I spent every daggone dime that I had. Oh, boy. Well, honestly, it was probably the best thing I could do at the moment. Well, I can get cash. I know where to go to grind gold bass. Oh, she just talks too much. I think I'm just going to go ahead and try the map challenge number two. And that is to find that map location. Which I believe is right up in here. But to be precise, I'm going to need to look at my journal again. Okay, that is the best I can get out of that map. But it's right here at the bend of that river. So right here. Somewhere in this vicinity. So we're going to set a waypoint there. And how far do we have to go to get there? There's the question. Okay, where's my waypoint marker there? Actually, I could probably walk there. I don't think I can jump there. I'm either going to have to walk or drive. I'm trying to decide whether it would be faster to walk. Because honestly, half of this is going to have to be by trail anyway. So yeah, I think I'm going to end up having to walk it. For the most part. Let's see, which way am I headed here? I need to go this way. So it's 0.7 miles. Eh, it's, a, it's just a short hike. No biggie. Yeah, I did put in one of my comments to one of you guys. I do have some stuff on my wish list for this game. One of which is a is a cabin. We need a cabin. We need a place we can go in and we can rest. We can advance time if we need to. That is something we desperately need. Let me get over here to the road. I think I can get there a little faster. I want a place where I can also possibly put trophies up. Like fish trophies of my my best, or at least pictures. I just want something that I can say, "Hey, I caught that, and that's my personal best so far." But we've got a little bit of walking to do here, guys. And since we're just doing some walking, I'm gonna basically ask you guys a few questions here. <coughs> this is this is on a side note here. Oh, it's. Rendering in some stuff here. There's a couple of games that I have been doing series on. It's by Dovetail Games. One is Fishing Sim World Pro. The other one is The Catch Carp and Course. Honestly, they have stopped supporting the two games. We have not gotten anything new on either one of them. I suspect that that's because they're coming up with something different or new. Because they have a tendency to do that on a, you know, regular basis. That particular 
group. Do you guys still want to see videos for these two two games? I mean, I do like playing the games. They're very, very similar in many ways. But I'm not sure if it's something that you guys want to continue seeing me do or if you guys are getting kind of fed up because I think some people are fed up with Dovetail Games on some things because they just really haven't done anything new much. <laughs> I mean, they, they kind of are right about that. I mean, they do need to do some work on that. But let me get, let me, I'm sorry, let, let me know in the description below, or not the description below. Anyway guys, let me know in the comments below about what you guys want to see. I am open to anything. I, I don't mind playing the games at all. In fact, they're, they're pretty fun. They are kind of similar, like I said. But I do like the Lock Mickle of... The Catch Carpent Course. It's probably my favorite lake of the two games. But anyway, let me know. And I will do whatever you guys want me to do. I will continue doing plenty of episodes of them. No issues. I just don't really know exactly what to do in them, to be perfectly honest. Yeah, the missions that you take part in seem to be adjusting the time. That's something I just noticed in the last episode. If you need to catch a certain species of fish, it's going to stick you in the best time frame for, for it. I'm not so sure what I think about that. I kind of like to be able to set the time the way I want to set it. Not the way the mission decides for me. That's just, that's just the thing for me. But I think we are in the right location here. I don't know if it's going to let me know when I found it. I would assume so. How close I have to be because based on... What is that noise? Oh, no, I'm I'm afraid I did find it. Okay, this is it. I did good, guys. I did good. Yeah, this is a little too shallow for a boat, I think. I, don't, I wonder if I could walk. No, I don't think I can walk across here. A little too deep. But I think we're going to see if we can't get our gold bass here. Shouldn't be too hard, I wouldn't think. Okay, we got our float rod. Let's see. We got this. What do we got on there bait-wise here? All right. We got this rod. We have the spinner bait. Now, spinner bait's a good one. A really good choice for the bass. I think we'll go with that for now. It's usually kind of a sure thing. I'm going to cast it right over there, kind of where... Whoa! Yeah, we definitely have some bass out there. <coughs> take the speed down to about one. There we go. We got our first bite here. Decent fish. Decent fish. I right, gotta watch that tension. If it is a bass, I don't know, it's not really fighting as hard as you, the bass normally do. I mean, we could be getting some trout here, too. Let's see what we got here. Okay, we got a silver. So, that's not bad. That's not bad. Silver's not bad, but not quite what we need. We might end up catching a few silver here. Some of these spots, I mean, 
seemed to center around certain sizes. It's like that one spot was definitely the gold largemouth bass area. That one that I caught the northern pike. I know where to go for them. If they get a legendary fish that's a, that's a northern pike, I'm headed there without a doubt. Kind of thinking maybe Goldstein, and I think, yeah, Goldstein was the bass, right? I'm thinking Goldstein might be in the gold trout lake. That's the best thing I can call it <laughs> the gold trout lake. Not the gold trout lake. The gold bass lake. Well, let me take a look at the map here. I, can I zoom in anymore? Well. <laughs> can't. This map is kind of hard to grab and move around sometimes. Okay, so I think if I get over on this side, might actually do a little bit better, but I can't cross right here. I'm going to have to go up here to get across. So I am going to go do, go ahead and go up there. Sorry about I keep getting tongue tied today. I don't know what my deal is here. Well, let me go ahead. I'm going to make the trip over there and I'll bring you back once I get there. All right, I got over here. And there is a dock there too. So that was probably where it was trying to lead me in the first place. I'm going to go ahead and grab this. Hey, it's 15 XP, man. Any extra XP is always a good thing, but let's get on this dock and try this now. This is probably the area that they wanted us to go in the first place. Let me go ahead and get my rod set up here. Let's try this frog. We'll see if this doesn't do what we need to have happen. Now this is a topwater lure, so we're going to I may need to take the thing down just a little bit. I'm just... I've been surprised by some of these bass. Alright, there we go. Okay, yeah, this one... Oh, he, he's he's doing a... Where the hell are you going, fish? Alright, let's see. He's not fighting as hard as I'd hope to. I just don't think this is a bass. If it is, he's really very relaxed. Oh, well, man, maybe not. Let me see here, guys. What do we got? Oh, there it is. I'm surprised. Yeah, the frog made all the difference, and getting to this location made a difference. Now, that probably... And we leveled up. Awesome. So, we need to talk back to Sophie. I am going to have to keep this one in mind. That's another thing. I was trying to remember what the other thing was, and that is... I wish that we could place... We can place waypoints. I'm good with that. Because that served a great purpose. The problem with that is, is they're only temporary. I would love to be able to place my own personal markers on here. So that if I find a hot spot like this one right here, and I find out that you know this is a real good place to catch gold largemouth bass, or this one here, definitely. I, I could place a marker wherever it is I'm catching them, and you know maybe put like a little identifier there or even a little fish it shows like a bass or a trout or something <coughs> a trout or something you know cuz that would make it easier for me to you know when I come back in here and I'm like okay I want to try to see if I can't find Goldstein I'm like well Goldstein could be here or Goldstein could be here I mean, it's it's just a thought. I don't know. Maybe it's a lot to ask yet because they're still working on stuff, but it's still on my wish list. 
All right, let's go talk to Sophie here. Ouch. Let's go talk to Sophie here, guys. Yeah, I'm not walking all the way back. It's just fast travel. I love the love the fast travel. I mean, it's a pain in the butt at first when you have to find all these, but once you do it, it is very helpful to just fast travel from point to point. Plus, gives her something to say. Okay, we're not going to buy anything, Sophie. Sorry. Um, yeah, I think I did get some gear, too. So that was... I think I can do my customization. I didn't do that the last time, but I can change some of these things here. Alright, guys. I think I've got her set up. I did get her some pink shorts, but the pink shorts just do not match the the shirt that she has for this I did get her the pink hat so I'm trying to decide if I just like this shirt better and nothing else seems to go with it so I think I'm gonna go with that I wish they gave us a little more options about our avatars to be honest uh, and also I wish that we had more expressions for them I think I wrote that down as well I wish we could get better pictures and they had a little bit more expression to their faces they all look so deadpan Looks like I think I wrote down it was like they look like they're at a funeral not catching a champion fish, you know? It's kinda weird. Well anyway, that's gonna have to be good enough for now. I might change her as I go a little bit further down the line, but I think I have done all that I can do for her at the moment. I am gonna check my journal again. Let's see, we've got Plenty of ones for her, but these are picture locations. And you can catch a gold rank yellow perch at this photo location. If you spend any time with old play, you've heard him talk about his son. One in, one out, that's the way of the world. Glad I can be here and not there. Well, let me get further away from her because she's interrupting. Sure you don't want to buy more? more e No, I want to be able to talk to my friends here. <laughs> okay, let's see here. There we go. I think I know where this is, but I'm not 100% certain. Uh, not well enough to make the trip over there only to find out. There's a couple of places that look very similar to this, guys. So the photo challenge is going to be very challenging at the moment. I'm just going to have to keep in mind, keep looking at these pictures so that when I see these areas, I'll recognize them. I might, I might know where this is. I don't know for sure, but let me make sure here. I was doing quite a bit of exploring and ran across some cool, cool areas. I think that might be up here. Maybe. Uh, I definitely had seen a waterfall. Maybe this this might be it. Spires drop. This might be it. We can fast travel. I can at least take a look. It doesn't cost anything or cause any problems to do that. But there is a waterfall here. So this took me actually up to the waterfall. Beautiful though. So I don't know if this is the correct waterfall. So I think there might be more than one. Alright, let's go down here and get to the base of it because that was what it was showing me. That I need to be somewhere down here. Yep, 
Yeah, this is a real, real tough to get up here. Climbing up here is not easy for your little character. It's not looking like it's going to be that easy to get here either. Well, let's do this. First of all, let's go to our inventory here again. I should have gone ahead and marked that. I didn't think of that. Let's see. Let me go ahead and track the mission. Ah, damn. I don't think I'm even close. Let me see here. Two point three miles? Oh no, that's the okay, no no no. I'm, I I'm picking up on the other marker I had. I'm sorry. This could still be it. So let's keep going down here. No, that was that bass location that I found earlier. I thought, no, wait a minute, they're just going to give it to me? No, they're not going to make it that easy. Well, it certainly looks good, but I think I'm still too close. Okay. Now, let's check the map. No, I don't think it's quite right. Well, actually, maybe it is. Yeah, I think it is. I think I'm almost there. guys I was right you can't see it in that little picture but you actually can see right over there that little sign but if you check on here on the map this is exactly where we are we're on this path right where this widens up right here at the foot of those falls but this is it so we need to come over here I assume See if we can't get us a yellow perch. Some fast moving water. I don't see any other place we could do. Maybe further down, but I don't know. Well, let's go ahead and bring our rod back out. We are going to need to change the bait. trying to remember what I caught them off of last time. I think... I think I just used a spinner. Or I could just float fish for them. I have a feeling that's going to be a little tough to do, though. But we'll go ahead and do... Yeah, we'll do this. We'll do this. Let's do the three. I don't see any. Obviously, it doesn't mean they're not here. Ah, we got something. We got something. Awesome. Come on. Come on. He's nibbling at it. He doesn't. I don't know. He doesn't look like a yellow perch to me. But he just seemed a little big on the big side but we'll see no I thought he was a little too big 
so he was a rainbow trout. Okay, I'm just going to take a look around, guys. There we go. All right. Let's see what we got here, guys. Come on. Rainbow Trout. just does not look like a good spot for, for perch. Maybe I'm wrong, but... I mean, usually they're just in... They usually like a little bit of cover nearby, you know? Okay, we got him. Ah, oh, some mountain whitefish. I don't know if you guys noticed my new gear. <laughs> I don't know. She just needs a little bit more of a makeover than that. I, I gave her the pink glasses and the hat. But she's still just so deadpan. God. It's like, you know, have fun with this, girl. <laughs> have some fun. This has to be the location. I mean, I can't imagine I need to go upstream a little bit. It really doesn't make it clear, though. It just says, go catch a gold rank yellow perch. That's all it says. Found the spot. I found the spot. There are perch here. And they've I've caught several silver... Let me show you on the map here where it is. It's right here, just as you walk across, there's like, like that little set of uh, logs that you walk across. I've been seeing them swimming around right here in front, and they are going for the spinnerbait. I just gotta. It's gonna make it easier if I could see one jump or swimming around. But they are right here, without a doubt. My problem is it is very easy to overthrow here, so just... You gotta kinda keep at it. But that little rock you see underwater, that's where they seem to be hanging out. I thought I was recording, guys. I was catching one silver perch after another, and then I realized, oh, shoot, I am not recording at all. thought I saw some movement over there, so I'm going to... It's like they suddenly just quit biting. Yeah, I'm going to let that drop down a little bit and see if I can't. Come on. Yeah, I ran out of that those blood worms. And that would have been a sure thing for float fishing. But when I tried to use the bread, they didn't even didn't even give it a second look. There we go. I thought I heard something over there. And it is a perch. Just not sure if it's big enough. A lot of silvers here. Yep, there's another silver. A lot of silvers.
Okay. Not sure what's going on with the sun. It seems like it keeps coming out and going behind the clouds. A sunny day would be so much better for these. Plus, I could see them better. There we go. Don't know here. I think it's another silver, though. This is the gold bass revisited here. Now we're getting silver. But like I said, the sun is out now. We might be able to see them a little bit better. If we can see a big one... seeing anything. Let's try and back up. Shoot. <coughs> really hard to cast here. <laughs> this is where I saw him the first time. I'm going to try this again. Yep, I see one. I can see one now. Doesn't look huge, though. And I'm not sure that he's interested either. But he's still there, so I'm going to do this again. Come on. Come on. There you go. Come on. Come on. Oh, you're going to be a butthole, aren't you? And he is probably our gold, because he looks big enough. He does look big enough, without a doubt. I'm going to try to pass this right over top of him if I can. I think I've got one going for it. Yep. There we go. It wasn't the one I saw, though. And I don't think he's... I don't think he's big enough, guys. I'm afraid I don't... I just don't think he's big enough. Damn it. Who would have thought it would be so tough to get a damn perch? Perch are usually easy. <laughs> well, specific perch. I guess it wouldn't be a challenge if it wasn't, I guess, quote, unquote, a challenge. Can't make it too easy. Let's see here. Alright, let's look and see if we see anything swimming around. Let's try back there again. We were having some luck on this side of things, too. It's pretty good to switch things up from time to time. In case we're spooking them. You can spook them. I've seen, I've seen it happen. Well. Okay, there's our, there's our fish again. Uh, 
killing me, people. There we go. That's a great cast right there. Right in front of that fella. Now it's... Let's see if he's interested. Okay, I think he's going over there. Yeah, he's going. He's going. He's interested. There he goes. Okay. Well, I tell you. That's all we're getting here, guys. We are just getting... Wait a minute, there's one right there. Right in frick in front of me. Come on. He may be a silver also, but... Let's see if he... Okay, he didn't, but another one did, so let's... Damn it. They all the same damn size? Alright, let's alright, alright, we're gonna Yeah, you look a little small, dude. Just look a little bit on the small side. I really really need that bait. Now, if he's over here, I wonder... Yeah, I don't see any over here. I'm going to come back down here again. I'm just going to get a good look over here and see if I see any over here. If there aren't any here, I think I am going to go back and try to get some more bait. Yeah, this game is actually getting a lot more fun every time. Actually, it gets more fun every time I play it. They've got a lot of work to do still, but it has come such a long way from that first time. Oh, there we go. The first time. No, this is not a perch, guys. This is something much bigger. Yeah, I think they're just much bigger over here. Now we've got us a decent rainbow here, I think. Oh, yeah. Silver. I think I went out a little too far. <laughs> That's all right. And if the perch are going to be here, they'll probably be around the periphery. <laughs> if they're dealing with other fish and they're that size, they're going to be kind of hanging out of their way. I might try between these rocks. But if we can't get anything, I know now where to catch them. I might just have to be a lot more patient. It may be a while before I get a gold. Well, alright. I think it is now time for us to see if we can't head back and get some more bait. We had to come quite a ways. Let's fast travel back to the old outpost. We found a lot of stuff. We learned a lot of stuff. We still got to get that gold rank yellow perch. And truth be known, we may have to just go back to that spot. But at least we know where it is now. But anyway, I think we're probably going to have to end this episode at this point, guys. I mean, really. 
because it has gone a little bit long as I usually do when I go on fishing expeditions but like I said I'm gonna need to get some bait and we're gonna before I go back there I am gonna see about heading north and I'm I might just start this over again cuz like I said this one's getting too long but we'll see if anything if there's an episode that comes out that says catching the great ghost Goldstein the legendary Goldstein <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be an interesting episode. But anyway, guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.